Welcome Pisces to your reading. The great news coming in for you this month. So we're going to go ahead and see all the possibilities and all the energies of this great news. Now just remember my dear Pisces, there's the messages that come through don't resonate with you. I don't want you to worry. It just means that this is not meant to be your reading at this time. And you can go ahead and look at your moon rising and Venus signs as they could have more relevant, more pertinent information for you. So I'm just pulling all your oracles. I'm sorry, all your tarot cards, all your tarot cards. Sorry, I just got distracted by the cards here because this is such a message here. Wow. Okay, so here we go. Wow, Pisces. Okay, Pisces, this is a relationship reading. So if that does not resonate with you, um, please go ahead and look at one of your other signs because this is very, very distinct and very clear in terms of a relationship reading. Okay, so here we go. Are you ready for this? Wow, amazing. It's starting off so clearly by telling you, Pisces, that this, now this is, this could re very well be for people who are looking for a relationship and even for those who are in a relationship, okay? It tells us for those who are looking for a relationship, the great news that's coming in, look how beautiful this card is, you are going to find somebody that just absolutely fills you up and your cup runneth over with love, okay? For those of you in a relationship, it tells you, guys, it's going to go well, you're doing well, you're progressing, you're moving on to the next step. With our three of wands, it just tells us, for, for my, my single Pisces, you've waited a long time for this. You've been, you know, you've really gone through a lot of experiences and you really had a very clear vision about who you wanted to bring into your life and what kind of a relationship you wanted. Same with my Pisces who are in, in, in a relationship. This is now taking th th things now going to the next level. It's like I'm ready. So for the Pi single Pisces, you're ready to bring this person in. And for my Pisces in a relationship, you're ready to take this relationship with all this fire burning around you, okay, with this, this energy that's alive and passionate, you're ready to dive right into this water and get out there and take it to the next level. Now, this is beautiful. There is somebody quite amazing that is, this is for my singles, and listen, even for my, my, um, my Pisces who are in a relationship, your partner is presenting as the King of Wands. Now, the King of Wands, it's just the energy of the cards, guys. The cards, my cards do not have gender. It's, so this is the King of Wands energy. Is They are presenting, if, even if they're male or female, okay? This is a beautiful, beautiful energy, and I love this because we have the lion here. Now, there's two reasons I, I love this. One, we are now in Leo season, so it just tells me that this is very relevant now. And it also, there is there is strength because nine of wands energies are very, very dynamic energy. This is a, this person is passionate. They're creative. They're dynamic. They know what they want. They go after it. They're entrepreneurial. They incredibly confident. They, they just, they're in a good, good place in life. And this is how your person or potential person is presenting, which is a wonderful energy. But it, look at this, and I love this. You've got the hierophant here. Can you please look at that smile? This is now what is happening. This person is going to elevate you in terms of a relationship to a whole new level, Pisces. And look at the joy that this is bringing in. This is your good news. This is your good news. You're going up, up to a whole new level level oh, and whatever that is for you guys okay so, so for some people it's meeting this perf this wonderful perfect counterpart okay for another person it's just maybe having a wild passionate fling okay everybody's different for some of you it's your partner proposing of you proposing so just take it as a real but that joy that happiness it's about your elevation into the next level and it tells you in no uncertain terms, Pisces, that all your previous experiences, 
Okay, so we have the devil coming in saying, you know, you've been there, there have been some really rough previous experiences and relationships, and nothing, nothing was in vain. Nothing. Please, I want you to understand that there was this, this hard times that you had to go through by being with different people and going through different experiences has all prepared you, okay? It prepared you for something so that you would understand what you wanted, what worked for you, what didn't for work. How do we know what we love? It's when we really know what we don't love, right? How do we know what we want in a partner? It's when we experience something with a person that we go, okay, that's something I really don't want, right? So it, this, they want you to know that all your experiences, because you know, you might have this feeling, oh, why didn't I meet them earlier? No, this was meant to happen now because you had to go through all of this to really fine tune and understand what was going to be good for you and what was going to bring you some joy. Now we've got this, we've got, listen, there's something happening here, guys. So, you know, for singles, you can expect some kind of offer to come in. It could be online with Page of Swords. This is like a communication. So it's it, it could be you meet somebody online, somebody introduces you, they send you a WhatsApp, let's meet. Okay, so there's some kind of electronic communication, maybe setting up the first date. There's, 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 there's communication back and forth. If you are, there's going to be some, there's a meeting here. There's, yes, yes, your, yes, your bouquet of flowers, your, your, your bunch of roses. For my Pisces in a relationship, beautiful. You can expect something like, you know, a little one liner, like just to test the waters, maybe. So, what do you think about moving in together, right? Just like, you know, little cheeky, sweet email, you know, or, or what's up. Really, really nice, but it's coming. It's here. Wow, this is so lovely. And here you are, my dear Pisces, Queen of Cups, doesn't matter if you're masculine or feminine, you're going to be so, it's so good for you. It's so good for you. It's, it's something you've wanted. It's something you've been praying for, visualizing, meditating on for a long, long time. And the opportunity is coming in. And now it's up to you what you do with it. Because as you can see, these roots coming off, growing, it's like you're going to be given something. And now where it goes, of course, it's in your hands. You are always in control. You decide the outcome, whether it's what you want, whether it's not what you don't want, you decide. But you're presenting as Queen of Cups, which is a very good place emotionally. Very, very good place emotionally. And it's like, wow, this is, this is what I've been waiting for. Now, just remember with Ace of Pentacles, it's an incredible opportunity. And it's up to, up to you to grow those roots and develop it further, further and further. So let's go ahead and pull some additional oracle cards for you. What else do we have for our Pisces? Perfect timing. My goodness, Pisces, you have to believe this. This is perfect timing, okay? This person is coming in or making the proposition to take it up a notch and it's all perfect timing. It's all exactly as it's meant to be. Right, let's go ahead and get another card for you. Freedom. Look at that. Right on the devil, okay? You are now free from whatever this was in the past, but the freedom you've learned, you understood, and now you are free to go out there to develop and grow something that works for you. Wow, you're free. You're free now. You are free to absolutely engage and take this up in whatever way works best for you. Right, one more card for our Pisces. Dragonfly Spirit. Truth transcends illusion. 22. Strong, strong power number. Please pay attention to the 22nd of August. I think it's going to be a very auspicious day for you. And you're going to see that whatever came before it was just preparing you. Because when it says truth transcends illusion, like this, these relationships, maybe you wanted things to happen so badly and you worked so hard. But the truth is when the right person comes with the right offer at the right time, you'll understand, wow, it's so easy when it's right.
So there you have it, my dear Pisces. I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. It just lets me know that you like this kind of content. If you'd like, you can also go ahead and subscribe to my channel. It just lets, it, it just really helps my channel and I would greatly appreciate it. And I'm sending you all lots and lots and lots of love. <music>